Five Tiles works on all Android devices, so you can find it on the Play Store. You have to look for Five Tiles keyboard and you can install it for free. Uh, as you can see, the keyboard does not require any special permissions, which means we are not capturing any data and it's very safe to use. After you downloaded and installed the, the keyboard, the next step is to open it and you have two steps uh, to follow. First, you need to activate the keyboard. So you look for 5 Tiles Pro, you activate and the next, the next thing is to select the keyboard as the preferred keyboard. So once you downloaded and activated the keyboard, it's time to, time to start writing. You can go to any text input app and this is your keyboard. So first I would like to uh, explain about the couple of areas that you're going to see on the keyboard. The keyboard itself is these five colorful keys. All the commands, symbols and letters you achieve by swiping on, the, on these five keys. This area on the top is called Cheat Sheets and this is where you can find all the combinations that you need if you ever forget them or if you don't know them yet. So you can flick through these uh, different pages and uh, you can access the Cheat Sheets at any time by swiping down on the orange key. So you swipe down on the orange to uh, switch the Cheat Sheets on and then if you don't need it anymore, you switch it off like this. Now this grey stripe is used for the dictionaries. You can use five tiles with or without the dictionaries and uh, I will show you now how to switch them on and off as well. So you will notice that on the second page of the cheat sheet you have the dictionaries and now you press and you will see that the, the dictionary has been switched off but also the cheat sheets show you the move to activate and deactivate these dictionaries which is uh, yellow, blue, green. So now when you switch the cheat sheets off you can also access the dictionaries by repeating this move yellow, blue, green. The next very important thing in the keyboard is the learning mode. You can access the learning mode by swiping up on the yellow key. In the learning mode, it is very easy to write the letters because once you find the letter that you want to write on the key, let's say we want to say hello, we're looking for H, it's on the green key, we press and hold and we see that uh, from green we have to slide to yellow to get H. Also, you, you see this grey arrow on top of the keyboard which, actually, which confirms that yes, actually, if you release right now, this is what you're gonna write, this is gonna be H. So then we find, we're looking for E, you press and hold, you slide to the red, and this is how you write E. L is gonna be yellow, and I see I have to slide to green. And the same goes for O. I press and hold, and I slide to the red. Now let's say I want to put some, uh, I want to put the exclamation mark. So all the punctuation starts and ends on the red key. So space is a single tap on the red. And if I release now, uh, I would get space to the text. Now if I want to delete this space, on top of the blue key I have a delete. And I slide up on the blue I delete. Now red and I'm going all the way left until I see the uh, exclamation mark. So it's red to green and now I have to go back and that's how I get the, the exclamation. If you ever forget, you go to the cheat sheets, you look for the page with uh, all the punctuation marks and now when you press the symbol it's going to write it in the text but also it gives you, it shows you the move for this. So this is very easy to remind you uh, which combination use for any given character. 